everyone welcome back to my channel thanks again for popping by i'm gonna get started with the time hop i was tagged by georgina clark so thank you very much for the tag it's just five questions um sort of going back into the past i guess a little bit so um i will get started so the first question is what were you doing this time last year and has your life changed in a big way since then um, well, this time last year I was pregnant with Marco, so no, <laughs> my life has not changed really because I am pregnant again. Um, I think I'm sort of a similar gestation actually. I think I was probably a little bit further along with Marco. Yeah, I think I was. This time last year I was about six, seven months pregnant with Marco. Um, and I'm currently six months pregnant with uh, baby number four. Uh, I think our life has changed, not in a huge way, but it has changed because we've welcomed another baby boy into the world, Marco, obviously. He did have a bit of a tough time, so um, it was a little bit stressful, but actually, no, our, our life as a general, as in like, what we do on a day-to-day -day hasn't really changed so I'd say no our life hasn't really changed in the last year um, I kind of feel like I'm in the same spot actually because I'm pregnant again and <laughs> question number two is check your Facebook time hop and share a cringy status from the past so I will just get <laughs> that up for you if I know how to um, on this day so where are we Okay, so on today, last year, uh, I'll show you the picture first. I don't know if you can see that. Oh, can you see? So it says, Lorenzo went to school for three hours today and Nico felt lost. The minute Lorenzo returns home, they do this. The bond these two have is perfect. And look, they just cuddled. It was so cute. Yeah, they really did miss each other, so... That was this time last year. Um, oh gosh, okay, I will share another photo. This was the 15th of September 2009. <laughs> so what was that, eight years ago? I did a photo shoot. I don't know if you can see this very well, but um, I don't know. The reflection's a bit funny, but I look back now, it's a little bit cringy, but yeah, I did a little photo shoot. And that was eight years ago today. Crazy. Let's see. Um, I think that's it. I didn't share any statuses. It's not giving me any statuses. I don't think I was much of a social media back then. I love it now, obviously. But yeah, it says that's all for the 15th of September, which is a bit poop. So question number three, if you could go back in time and do things differently, what would they be? Well, I would definitely, number one would be to um, stick up for myself more at school. I was bullied at school and I just kind of felt like I took it and didn't say anything back. And I really, really wish that if I could go back in time, I'd stand up for myself stick up for myself a little bit more and give the bullies what for <laughs> give it back to them like they gave it to me because yeah I kind of wish I regret that so much and I feel like if that happened to me today I would completely do that but obviously I've changed as a person and as you become a mum I believe you get stronger and you don't take any crap so yeah I would definitely that would be my number one was to stick up for myself a lot more I would not have got my nose pierced. <laughs> I loved it at the time, but I hate it. I, oh, I, I, I grew to hate it. And uh, it's left a scar on my nose, which is really annoying. And I tend to cover it up on a daily basis Well, when I wear makeup. So I kind of wish that I never had my nose pierced. And number three was to stick at my dancing. I was a dancer back in the day and it was everything. It was, I absolutely loved it. It was just the best thing that I ever did. And um, yeah, it just kind of fizzled out. I think as I got older and <laughs> boyfriends and things like that. And yeah, and then kids came along and obviously they're my priority and I would love to one day. So Ben, if you are watching, you are gonna come back and you are gonna teach me some dancing. <laughs> So yeah, I really wish I would stick at my dancing a little bit more. So question number four is scroll down your Instagram feed for 10 seconds or 10 swipes without looking and share the picture, the date and the caption. 
So I'm going to go for 10 seconds. Ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I'm going to choose a picture and. Oh. <laughs> Oh, this is a cute one. So look, this is little Marco. Bless his little heart. I don't know if you can see that. It's probably quite blurry. But this was the 10th of November, 2016. And the caption is complete Marco overload. I do apologize. Not how scrummy is he in the hat that I made for his teeny little head. That was it. I crocheted that hat for Marco. Well, actually, I think I did it for... No, I did that one for Marco because that's a small baby. I don't know if you can see it. Oh, look how cute he is. He was so tiny and that hat that I crocheted was just the smallest thing. I was crocheting it and I thought, surely not, that can't fit his head. And it fit him for ages, I think, because he, he was so little. Yeah, and it was just the cutest little thing. But he looks so scrummy. Make sure if you don't follow me on Instagram, then head over there. I'll put the link in the description box below and go and follow me. And question number five is, where do you want to be this time next year? Um, well, hopefully not pregnant. <laughs> Um, I would just love to enjoy being a family of six. I'm sure it's going to take a while to get settled in. Obviously, we've hopefully brought a new house and we, we need to get a new car and things like that. So hopefully we'll feel a little bit more settled. Everything's a bit up in the air at the moment. We're living in an empty house. I know there's probably not much behind me because we've taken everything off the walls. We're kind of living out of boxes and yeah, it's just a bit annoying really. So um, hopefully this time next year we'll be settled in our new home just enjoying being a family of six and yeah just watching the boys grow oh, so nice. do you want to come and join me yeah you want to come and join me i have another one joining me so yeah this time next year i'd just love to feel settled in our new home and just enjoy being a family of six um and not be pregnant <laughs> hopefully well i say hopefully obviously i'd love to be pregnant again of course i would but i don't know i just think like next year is probably too soon seeing as it's kind of been consecutive years now and I think I need a little bit of a break so yeah anyway I hope you enjoyed my time hop tag thank you very much for the tag Georgina and I will tag some people below in the description box so um go and check those out and I'll also link some other time hops that I've enjoyed watching in the description box below as well so go and check those out if you find these sort of videos interesting I will also put the link to my Twitter and my Instagram down below um, and if you don't follow me then please do and obviously subscribe if you enjoy watching my videos and you haven't yet subscribed then please do I'd be really really grateful um, thank you guys for watching and I will see you in my next video <laughs> bye Marco say bye Say bye. Say bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. <laughs> You're so cute. Bye guys.